Hi guys, good morning. Welcome to my channel. My name is Olido Chatty. So guys, in this video, I'll be showing us what I eat in a day to manage and control my fire bread and also to um, shrink the size of my fire bread. So I'll be showing you guys in this video what I eat in a day to shrink my fire bread. So I just woke up now and, you know, it rained heavily last night. So um I, i'm in the kitchen now to make myself a cup of green tea so i'm showing you guys this is about 7 9 a.m in the morning yeah it's morning already so So one of the things I think in the morning when I wake up is to take my green tea and feel good. <coughs> it rained last night, so the weather is so cold, you know. So the best way to the best way to make myself feel good is to take my green tea and you know relax around eight nine. On 9 30 i can have my breakfast then that so i'll be showing you guys what i eat every morning what i eat every day to manage and control the size of my favorite so that's what i'll be sharing in this video to my new subscribers thanks for subscribing to my old subscribers thank, thank you guys for staying by i really really appreciate you guys so guys please bear with me i'm not using mic so i don't know how this the sound is but just bear with me okay so that's all now. That's all for now. So see you guys when I'm about to prepare my breakfast. I'll be showing you. Bye guys. So I'm ready to I'm ready to make to prepare my oats this morning. So this is a 821 a.m. It's about 821 a.m. Okay. And this morning I'll be making oats porridge, okay, with apple. I'll be showing you guys how I do it. So um, oats is a very healthy breakfast option here in Nigeria and any other place, okay? And that is because oats is loaded with fiber and it keeps you full for a longer period of time. So this is what I'll be having this morning. Normally, I don't like eating in the morning, okay? I'm not someone that like taking breakfast, okay? I usually take my, my first meal around 12 or 1, depending. But today, I'll be having my breakfast and I'll be showing you guys how I prepare it, okay? So that is it for today. And okay, I have other things I'll, I'll, I have to do because I have to cook okay, for people in the house. <laughs> Everybody's not eating this with me, okay? I'm doing it because I'm trying to shrink my fibroid and you know, manage my symptoms properly. So that does not mean I don't cook other food for people in the house. I still make their own meals for them, okay? Yeah, so let's see. Guys, please, this, I'm, not making, I'm not using microphone. I don't know. It's, it's like my voice is echoing, but please bear with me, okay? It's not gonna happen next time. Next video, I'll make sure I'll make sure I, I, I use uh, my my mic. Okay, it's going to reduce the you know the whole bag and um, let's do the thing. Because at times, it's how you make wood, you know, you're making it for weight gain, and it's how you prepare it. You prepare it, you know, that 
you're preparing for weight loss okay so in as much as i'm trying to 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 shrink my fibroid size i'm also trying to lose weight okay so this is how you prepare oats you know you're making it for weight gain so i don't really like my oats with a lot of toppings i only take oats with a with apple or i can add cashew nuts or cinnamon or but i don't want to add any of those things okay i just prefer it only with apple and it's very delicious with apple like this so this is how i make my oats so when you're making your oats make sure make sure you mind the quantity you're making because oats can also be taken for weight gain okay. so and the healthiest thing you can take in the morning is oat. Oat is very healthy. It's loaded with a lot of nutrients, fiber, and all of that that can help relieve your fibroid symptoms. So I recommend oats for breakfast if you know you're struggling with fibroid. So you can have oats, and there's so many other things you can take in the morning apart from oats. Okay, but mainly I love taking oats because it helps a lot. Okay, and if, if you're trying to curb your appetite, oats is another thing you should be taking. Okay, to help to curb your your appetite okay or um, hold your your hunger pang okay so you won't be eating much you're trying to lose weight too because that's another thing i'm i'm battling okay i also want to lose weight okay so i recommend oats okay mm. so guys i'm having a little break up on my face that's because I don't know, before my period last week, okay, I don't know, I had this crazy pimple on my face and I'm working on it, I'm doing something to clear it, so when I'm done with that, I'll be sharing what I use to clear this acne, okay, so that's all guys, see you guys in the afternoon, because I have other things I will do, okay, I'm not the only one in the house, so I have to cook for the Hi guys, good afternoon, so this is about 2.32pm, okay, so I'm here to make my lunch so I'll be showing you guys how I prepare it and you know, mostly I like making cabbage soup in the afternoon because so guys, I'm making a cabbage soup okay I'm making cabbage soup today so it's one of the vegetables, plant vegetables that is very good for someone that has fibroid okay you need cabbage, cabbage has a lot of nutrients, cabbage has Cabbage has a lot of health benefits, very good for weight loss, very helpful for fiber So I'm preparing carrot and um, cabbage soup. So I'm showing you guys how I make it. So let's see.
no matter what it, it, it is that you're making no matter what it is that you're making make sure you're not frying you avoid fried food so if if at all i don't add oil to this i'll just oil it won't add oil to it a spoon of oil is okay and i use goya i use olive oil but i try to avoid using a lot of oil for you can make this with with chicken stock or whatever you want to make but i don't have chicken stock i prepared my today's food with goat meat which I don't have chicken stock today. What I have is goat meat, but I won't be eating goat meat because I'm running away from goat meat. I should be taking, I add a little water here so to make, make it more like soup. <laughs> Not too spicy just added black pepper normal pepper to it it, it, it tastes really nice okay it tastes really very nice so you can try it and tell me what you feel okay for me i don't think you need rice for this because after downloading this i think you feel very so guys i'm getting ready now to go out because i want to go and see what's happening outside okay have something now um i'm doing now See you guys in my next video. Guys, good evening. So I'm just coming back from um Oka is having their masquerade festival. Okay, they're in Oka. So I'm just coming back. I went to see some friends. Um it's just 7 44 p.m. in the evening. Yeah, it's just 7 44 p.m. So um I don't really feel hungry or I'll be taking them. Um, I'll be blending my pineapple and cucumber. This is what I'll be having this evening, okay? Uh, I think I'll be sharing this with my daughter because it's, even, it's too much. So, pineapple is much. So, I'll be sharing some with my daughter and I'll also keep some in the freezer. Okay, those the ones that remain, I'll put it in the freezer. Okay, so. From outside is too much but let me just see i don't know, i hope you guys can hear me okay in my next videos in my next video guys i'll be doing a three day uh, fruit fast i'll be doing a three days um fruit fast okay 
um just you know i do a three days then um, fruit fast i don't know thank you guys for subscribing and watching my video and see you in my next video when i decide on the video to make you're gonna see that on saturday whatever video whatever whichever one i choose to make will be coming up on saturday thanks for watching guys